Keep watching Charis TV. There's, there's an issue about marriage. Y yeah, yes, eh? yes, that the, the marriage issue is coming from your forefathers. Yes, that you people here, your forefathers, you marry, remarry, marry, remarry, and children everywhere. Yes, that and now it's happening to you now. Yes, so that I need to pray for you. Uh, after this, God is going to open doors for you in the ministry. I'm Pastor Andy of Divine Peace Global Network an apostle and evangelical movement uh, that focus on winning souls and uh, training the ministers into the work of the ministry. So first of all I was just to thank uh, Daddy and you know Mama for, for you know for giving this opportunity to share and confirm the prophecy. So anyway I didn't plan to come to church this morning but God said you know what just go to church this morning because there's a grace of elevation I didn't know what God was what, what I was saying I didn't know what was that meant but when I came here just Papa just you know called me and prophesied unto my life and he touched two issues one was the issue of you know of marriage you know my father had you know children outside marriage and he was an apostle at the same time. Now he passed on, and I didn't take it very serious. You know. And number two, he took the issues of ministry. He said, I see an open door for the ministry, because this is what I was praying for, that God, please open the door so that we may impart you know, into the borders. We will go beyond the borders and open other branches. So I confirm the prophecy to be true, because it was hard for me you know, to get someone you understand and last year I last year I came and Papa prayed for me and God blessed me with you know <laughs> with a woman that loved God and I put a ring this year and soon we will be married. I, I you know I confirmed that this was you know a confirmation for what was happening in my life. So I you know I'm so excited because this year I will come back with my wife and this year I will come back again with the testimony of the ministry going beyond the borders. How are you feeling? I'm feeling so excited, I'm feeling so loosey and I'm feeling so confident. I'm feeling so strong and I just believe that when I go back home, I'm just going to prepare the ministry to go beyond the borders. I'm going to tell my lady that you know what, prepare for marriage because we are about to get married. Yeah. We give glory to Jesus for our life. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. That lady who's wearing white, every time Sister, you see people coming to you, huh? Yes. Huh? Yes. And these people, they want to mess up your life. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. They want to mess up your life, these people. Because there are some certain things that they are trying to teach you. Yes. Huh? Yes. You are saying what? And this thing now, as long as it has been going on, yes, it doesn't want to end. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. So today, these people, they've con it's like they took your spirit, they put it in a container, they close. And if I tell you who's doing this, you can be shocked. Telling you, you can take it down. If I tell you who's doing this, I, touch that stomach. I reverse this case in the name of Jesus. Come out! Because this lady, she can go where they're having a meeting. You see where people are having a meeting? of the night and find it. If you ask her, she can tell you a lot of things. She can go there where, where witches are holding you. She can hear everything. This is not the time you come to church, you play. Oh, you know me? It's not the time to do it. You come to church to play. More especially a church like this one. I mean, you can go and play somewhere. 
not dear. Out! Come out, you demon! I want to pray for you. Come here. I want to pray for you. Amen. Are you hearing me? Because of the stagnation that you are in. And we need to cancel a spirit. At home, there's a spirit. When you reach a certain age, high blood comes to you. Mm. Sometimes even you, you don't understand your body now. Amen. It becomes hot and cold. Mm. Are you hearing me? Amen. So, but after I pray for you, th this demon won't come to you. Because it's the one that is caging you everything. Nothing is working out. I want, to pray for you. I want to pray for you. Are you hearing me? Okay. Because of what happened to you when you were growing up. There was your mom, she cried a lot. Amen. About some things that were happening in your life. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. Come here. Where's your mom? Come here. There are things that happen to you when you're growing up. And that, those things, they have affected your life. Amen. One of them is the issue of school. Amen. And now, here, everyone in the family was trying to go to school. But on you, everything was difficult. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. So now, I want to pray for you. So that even these ones who went to school must be better than them. And there's a spirit, as I was telling that lady, there's a spirit that is feeding you also. Are you hearing me? Amen. A spirit that is feeding you. And this has blocked your life. It's true. Blocked your life. I'm not seeing anything moving here. It's and true. You people here, there's an attack. Alcohol at home. Everyone is just drinking. Mm. So, but I'll pray for you. And I believe it's not late. Amen. It's not late. Your mother, she didn't tell you about a child that passed away. He told me. Huh? He told me. She didn't tell you about the child that passed away. Yes. She told you. Yes. Because since that child passed away, the child has been coming to your mom. It's like a spirit of death. You're free. You're free. Everything, Christian brother. This thing has fallen. I saw people come in to take a car. Yes, that's true. Eh? That's true, David. I saw people taking a car away from you. That's true. And you are worried. Yes. Eh? That's true. This thing has fallen down. It was like it was moving fast, but people came and take a car. That's true, David. And from there, it's like you are blocked. That's eh? true. Yep. God will restore you. Amen. I said, God will restore you. Amen. Go restore you. Amen. Go. Go. Take it. Go in. Demon. Jesus Christ. And then you, you are, you are regretting. Because it's, it took God for you to come back here. The way That's I'm true, here. Daddy. Eh? That's true. You, because you are regretting. You were, it's like Satan took you away, but it took God for you to come back. No one sees, uh, no one knows you here. That's but true. you have to regret. No one knows you here. When you come to God, you are coming to yourself. Amen. For yourself. Amen. You understand? God loves you. Amen. Uh, my name is Elvis Mabaso. I'm coming from Nelspread in Pomalanga. Mm -hmm. The prophecy that I received today is true mm -hmm. uh, regarding the car that uh, the bank won't take it away. Mm -hmm. 
So I confirm the profit is 100% true. With this issue of the bank wanting to take your car, how did it affect you? Yeah, like the apostle said, uh, he said uh, it's troubling me a lot, which yeah. is true. That's why I came here. I knew that today is my day. Amen. And by the grace of God, you were located. How are you feeling? Uh, actually, I was meditating that let the apostle locate me today. Amen. And that's what happened. Amen. And as they prayed for you, prophesied you, what are the words of encouragement that you can give to the viewers out there? As I believe that the Almighty God has done it for you in Jesus' name. The advice that I can give to the world is... Believe in the word of God, believe in the prophecy. Amen. Whatever you hear from the men of God, they receive it and take it, it will come to pass. Hallelujah. We give glory to Jesus for your life. Thank you, sir. Amen. So, sister, you must fight. You hear me? It's an opportunity. That God has given you. When God gives you opportunity, you don't play with it. You hear that? Huh? Amen. So this is an opportunity. Someone is coming from there. Amen. Now God place you there. Amen. Thank you. You understand? Amen. So that we don't fight. Amen. Stand with this man. Amen. You hear me? Amen. You hear what I said? Amen. I'm telling you, it's your wife. Huh? Yes. I'm telling your wife. Amen. Did you tell her that? Pardon? I'm saying she must know that someone was there. Amen. So now if you come, you become the second. Huh? Now you're the second wife now. Amen. And uh, don't take advantage of saying this is the second me, this man is like this. He stand with him. Amen. Go on to use this man. Amen. You hear that? Amen. Come on. This thing must leave it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Leave it. Come on. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. You demon. Jesus. 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 So you stand together, you'll make it. Mama, we need to pray for you. You, yes. I want to pray for you. So we need to pray for your, your marriage. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Satan is fighting your house. Amen. Say yes or no. Yes. Yes, he's fighting. Satan is fighting your house. Yes. Sister? It's true. I'm seeing a spirit here. Amen. You know, that is making people to argue. Amen. And sometimes the problem is money here. Amen. It's like the enemy is attacking your money so that you must fight in the, in the house. Amen. You hear me? Amen. And we also need to pray for you. There's an attack here in the stomach here. Amen. You hear me? So today I believe I will pray for you and God will save your house. Amen. Uh, there are many times this man is feeling like he made a wrong choice. Amen. Do you know that? Yes. Huh? He told you? I feel it. <laughs> many times. And sometimes he's thinking that you don't respect. Amen. Did he tell you? Sometimes. He told you sometimes that you don't respect him. Yes. Huh? Tell me. Hmm? Yes, he do. He told you that you don't respect him. Yes. So what are you doing about it? I'm trying to respect him. You are trying to respect him. Yes. So today after I pray for you, uh, God must help your house. Amen. Oh, you hear me? Amen. Well, this man here is dying inside him. He's dying inside. He has been crying a lot about the issue of respect. It's like I'm not respecting him. I'm not respecting him. So go and do it. Go and respect him. God will bless you. Amen. Amen.
It was your wife, sister. You're, you're attacked. There's a spirit that comes to you. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. The spirit is trying to feed you. That's why there's a problem here. Sometimes you hear cramps here. So business. Amen. When I'm praying for you. Amen. I saw you trying to do business. Amen. But nothing is working out. Amen. Well, sister, your it's husband true. has been trying to do business. Yes, it's true. But there's nothing that is working. It's true. It's like you are you're losing. You're losing. No, yes. don't worry, God will bless you. I saw that God will lift you up. One day Amen. you'll have a shop. Amen. You see a shop. God will bless you. He will give you a shop of clothes one day. Amen. 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 You're blessed. Amen. Are you blessed? Mama, we, we need to cancel this spirit. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes, We need to cancel God. a spirit at home. Yes, man of, of God. Of you people failing to marry. Yes, man of God, it's true. You people are failing to marry. Are you hearing me? Yes, man of God, it's true. And now, number two, I want to pray because I saw, I don't know, I saw a house. Huh? Yes, man of God. I saw a house. Are you staying in RDP? No, man of God. I'm huh? staying in a bond house. You're staying in a bond house? Yes, but I want to buy an RDP from someone who's selling. Give glory to God. I said, I'm seeing an RDP house. Huh? Yes, man of I'm God. I'm seeing RDP. And this RDP, it looks like you want to do business. Yes, man of God. Huh? I want to put someone to rent on it. You want to put someone to rent on it? Yes, man of Listen, God. Listen, I'll pray for you and you'll give us a testimony. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes, man of you God. You give us a testimony, but people have been disappointing you. It's true, man of a God. Lot. It's true. And I'm seeing from now on you must not to give anyone money. It's true. Don't borrow anyone money. Yes, man of God. <laughs> I've been borrowing people Don't money. Don't borrow anyone <laughs> money. I'm, I, if I speak something, I know what I'm saying. <laughs> you heard what I said? Yes, man of God, I'm Because hearing. many of them, they are failing to bring it back. Yes, it's true. And now, you find there's a fight now. It's true, man of huh? God. They become you enemies. You are fighting with these people. So it's don't true, borrow anyone God. money. Anyone who has money must go to the bank <laughs> to take a loan. Yes. In Jesus' name. What are you doing here? Huh? Come on. Out, you dick! Come out! Out, you dirty spirit! Sister, we need to pray for you. You. Let's pray for your sister. You. This one. You. This one. 
Maybe, maybe my eyes are, are not straight. I'm pretty straight. We need to pray for your sister. Oh, Amen. You hear me? Amen. We need to pray for your sister. Okay. She really needs serious prayers. Okay, men of God. Um, there's a lot of plans that she's having. Huh? Sorry? She's having a lot of plans. Okay. Even on the business side. Yes. Are oh, you hearing me? Yes. So go and tell her, I saw that God will bless her even on the issues of property. Okay. I will tell her. And she, she must not give up. Okay. She must not give up. But go and tell her that she also needs to be careful. She must not speak everything. Okay. I, I don't know. I'm trying to put it nice. When it comes to uh, the servants of God. Huh? Okay, yes, men of God. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, I know. Huh? Yes. When it comes to servants of God, she needs to close her mouth. Okay. I know what you're talking about. God loves her too much. Can okay. I get a small volume? God loves her, but when it comes to the what? The servants of God, she must. She must close her mouth. Okay. You know what she has been saying, huh? Yes, I know. Huh? I know. So God loves her too much. Thank you. And I will pray for her. Things will work. Because at the present moment, she doesn't believe also much in marriage issues. Yes, she doesn't believe. So now, before God, there is nothing that is called too late. Lift up your hands. I will pray for you. By praying for you, I will be praying for her. Okay. In Jesus' name. You're blessed. You. We need to pray for you. Are you hearing me? Amen. This is someone has attacked you with the spirit of hate. With the spirit of of hate. Of hate. People when they look at you, they just hate you. That is true. As some say, someone has given you that spirit, and this spirit is working against you. That Nothing is, is true. working out. Are you hearing me? Amen. And I cancel the spirit of disappointments in Jesus' name. You're free. Sister, can you stand up? Yes, yes. Please, don't worry about home. Okay, Daddy. You, you understand? Amen, Daddy. Don't worry about home. There's too much problems there. A lot, Daddy. Eh? A lot. And then these problems here, they are troubling you. Yes. Sometimes you can't pray. I can't. So and people right. think you are making money here. Yes, Daddy. Eh? Yes, Daddy. And they have to start to de depend on you. Yes, Daddy. But this year, especially May, May is going to be a great month for you. Amen. Don't touch it, don't touch it, don't touch it. Don't touch it, don't touch it. Don't touch it. There's power that is entering it. There's power entering it after I spoke. There's power entering it. Don't touch it. Don't touch it because this is a serious battle. Can you just come here, brother? Mama, I want to pray for you. Oh, you hear me? I want to pray for you. There's an attack on you. There's an attack, a serious attack. Okay. And this attack is coming from what was happening in the family before. Are oh, you hearing me? Yeah. People of the family, they used to do some sacrifices. So now this attack has blocked almost everyone. Yeah, it's true. In the family. It's true. Because I'm seeing them burning some things. When you people are still growing up. Yes. They used they to burn some man. things. Yes, they used to burn some things. And I'm seeing some sangomas surrounding the house, uh, trying to do some things there. Cha 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 cha. Since then, nothing is working out in everyone's life. If you go up, you go down. 
Yeah, it's true. If you go up, you go down. If you marry, you divorce. Yes, it's true. So now today I'll pray for you. God will help you. There's a, I'm still hearing, there's a lady there called Asan, Asan, Dawas, Ayan, Sude. Sister, there's a man who disappointed you. Yes. Huh? Yes. Huh? Yes, even now he left, I don't know where he is. What? Even now he's not at home, he left. There's a man who disappointed you. Yes. I'm seeing this man, he's not living right. Yes. Are oh, you hearing me? I'm seeing, sometimes he goes. Even before he, he leaves this now, now he has left, right? But there was a time you will go and come back the following day. Yeah. Huh? Yes. Is he working as police? No, he just got hired now. He just got a job now. Huh? He just got a new job now. He got a new job? Yes. Huh? Yes. Were you not involved with someone who's police? No, he was a driver before. What? He was a taxi driver before. You were not involved with the metro police? No. Someone who works as Metro? No. We just got a job now as a prison ward. That's what? What? We just got a job. Are you not in... Uh, in, in I'm, I don't know. I'm speaking with you, but I'm seeing police. Where is he working? He just got a new job now as a prison ward. As a prison ward? Yes. He's not police. Yes, yes. Ah. Sorry. I, it's like you speak one thing, one thing. I'm saying I'm seeing police. I don't know. I'm just, I'm looking at you. I'm seeing police. I'm seeing this man. He's working as a, I don't know. I'm a prison warder. It's not police. It is. Ah. Or maybe it's my chicken line. <laughs> it's not police. But he has left. The issue is, uh, but... This thing is painful. You, when you are suffering, I mean, you tell this person, I love you, I love you, I love you. The minute you get money, a better salary than where you're working, you say, I, no, 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 no. I must find a better person. I mean, you think your life will, will be good. Your life won't be good. Listen, there are many uh, single guys here in church. <laughs> he must hear, you know, that one day. In fact, he must see, he must get a, they call it what? Wedding invitation. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Listen, God will disappoint your enemies. Amen. We need to pray for you. Amen. We don't need to pray for you. Amen. I saw a problem. Amen. And this is not only you. Amen. In the, this thing is in the family. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hundred percent. You people, you marry, you divorce. Yes, sir. Hundred percent. Marry, divorce. Hundred percent. And I'm seeing children. Yes, sir. Yes, you sir. You hear me? Yes, sir. And this is working against all the businesses you want to do. Yes, hundred percent, sir. I've got contracts, tenders that have been suspended. And all my business associates, they don't want to talk to me anymore. That's what I'm telling you. That this situation now, it's working against you. It's blocking everything about business. Amen. I'm not seeing anything happening now. Nothing. Nothing, sir. Since the issue of the divorce. Yes, sir. Yes, there sir. There have been problems. Yes, sir. So now the question is, who's wrong between you and the wife? I think I'm the one to blame, sir. Because you're not living right. Yes, sir. Clap hands for this man. The spirit has attacked everyone. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Everyone. Yes, sir. And you people here, you're business minded. You very, very business minded, sir. But everything. Yes, sir. Went down. Yes, sir. Listen. I want to pray for you. Thank you, sir. I want God to help you. Thank you, sir. This la that lady was not wrong. Yes, sir. I, I wish I can see this lady. Mm. 
the lady was not wrong. Even though sometimes when she talks, it was not good. Yes, sir. It was very painful, yes, sir. When she speaks, it's because you are the one, who, you made it to be that way. Yes, sir. I mean, if we don't reprimand you in the church, where are we going to reprimand you? Today I'll pray for you. Yes, thank you, Go sir. Go and live your life right. Amen. But if, for me, my wish, I wish this lady can come back. Amen. And you make your way straight. Amen. Make your ways right with the Lord. Amen. Because you people, when you are here, you're also there. Yes, sir. I'm seeing children here. Yes, sir. Everywhere. Yes, sir. So, but today I'll pray for you. God will help you. Amen. You're free, sir. You're free. Your businesses will come back. Amen. I receive it. Thank because you so much. You're, you have caused a lot of problems. Amen. Oh, you hear know me? Yes, sir. You have caused a lot of problems. And now, there's no one who wants to do anything together with you now. Nothing. Nobody. Nobody, sir. So, but God has restored you. Thank you, sir. Amen. You're blessed. You're blessed.